What's up guys, in this tutorial I'll teach you how to put your face cam in your gameplay. In this video I'll show you how to put your face cam footage onto your gameplay footage. To see how I recorded everything, check out part 1. So first of all in Windows Movie Maker you start off uh, by clicking the webcam video here. I'll be using Sony Vegas Pro. So let's take the cam footage and stick it in there, timeline. There's what I recorded in part 1. Right, 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 right. And my gameplay footage recorded with the Xtori, I'm going to stick that right underneath. Now they're both obviously in different lengths, that's because I started recording the webcam earlier. But what we got to do here is turn off the auto ripple, if it's not already off, for now. I'll turn it back on later because it's useful for editing. But now we got to find the clap. So, uh, where did I clap? Do, 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 do. Pow, there's the clap right there. Boosh. Uh, and then I gotta sync it up with in the gameplay where I recorded the clap. Now I told you you can see it in the waveform. So you can see right around here, there's a quite a sharp bit, and that's where the clap is. So I gotta line them up as best as I can. And that's pretty good lined up. I'm not be able to get better because it'll jump around too much. So that's the clap lined up. Good enough for me. Now I'll take the beginning of the webcam footage, trim it to be equal to the length of the gameplay footage. I'll get rid of the webcam audio track. I mean, it's identical to the gameplay audio track, so I'll get rid of it. And then trim the end of it down to here. Now I'll select everything and press G to group it together. So now it's all in one piece. So I know it's recording. Now the last thing I gotta do is scale this webcam, because the, the both of the video tracks are here. All I gotta do now is scale the webcam to sit in the corner like this. What I did is I clicked that little, the cropping event pan crop at the very beginning, because if you do it anywhere else, you create a keyframe and it'll start animating. And then I made the frame really big and I will make sure that my face is in a corner. So now if I you saw, if you play see anything, the clap in the camera, you'll see me there talking over myself. So that's it, very simple. I'll uh, do some slightly more advanced tutorials later, like putting uh, borders and logos in, uh, and that will be my overlay tutorial, so check out that one. I'll put a link in the description when it's live. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.